oxidation reaction of carbon compounds. In this module, you will learn about the oxidation reaction of carbon compounds. We already know that carbon compounds, for example methane, undergoes combustion in the presence of oxygen to give carbon dioxide, water and energy. If we look at the structure of methane and that of the products of its combustion, we notice that oxygen is added to the atoms of a methane molecule, thereby forming the products. The chemical reactions that involve the addition of oxygen to a compound are termed as oxidation reactions. Combustion is not the only oxidation reaction of carbon compounds, but there are many others. Let's check out those. Shown here is a test tube containing a carbon compound, methanol. On adding alkaline potassium permanganate to the test tube, another compound called methanoic acid is formed. On comparing the structure of methanol and methanoic acid, we can see that a methanol molecule has only one oxygen atom attached to the carbon atom. Whereas, in a molecule of methanoic acid, there are two oxygen atoms attached to the carbon atom. So, we can say that methanol undergoes oxidation in the presence of alkaline potassium permanganate to give methanoic acid. Similarly, let's take another carbon compound, ethanol, in a test tube. Now add a small amount of acidified potassium dichromate to it. It will result in the formation of another carbon compound, ethanoic acid. Once again, if we compare the structure of ethanol and ethanoic acid, we get to see that in an ethanol molecule, there is only one oxygen atom attached to one of the carbon atoms. On the other hand, in a molecule of ethanoic acid, there are two oxygen atoms attached to the same carbon atom. So we can say that ethanol undergoes oxidation to give ethanoic acid in the presence of acidified potassium dichromate. So we have seen that carbon compounds like methanol and ethanol undergo oxidation in the presence of other compounds like alkaline potassium permanganate and acidified potassium dichromate. The substances like alkaline potassium permanganate and acidified potassium dichromate that are capable of oxidizing other substances are known as oxidizing agents. Let's recap. The chemical reactions that involve the addition of oxygen to a compound are termed as oxidation reactions. Combustion of a compound is a type of oxidation reaction. Many carbon compounds undergo oxidation in the presence of compounds like alkaline potassium permanganate and acidified potassium dichromate. The substances that are capable of oxidizing other substances are known as oxidizing agents.